With 108 wind turbines producing almost 400 megawatts, west of Dublin Sands, a joint venture of Dong Energy and Scottish Power Renewables is one of the larger European wind farms. Boscalis Offshore and Volker Stevin Offshore in an offshore wind force joint venture were responsible for the transport and installation of the 108 foundations needed. The wind farm is located in the Irish Sea. The water depth is 18 to 24 meters with a large tide difference of just over 8 meters. After winning the contract in the second quarter of 2012, a large team of experts worked on all the different aspects of the project. Complex technical designs were produced for tailor-made equipment and methods. Materials were sourced and complex risk assessments conducted. And, above all, all the separate locations and subcontractors were streamlined into one efficient operation with safety as a core value. Ever since the work kicked off in the first quarter of 2013, about 200 skilled professionals have been working on the project. Before the monopiles could be placed, the Boscalis Rock Piper, the largest fall pipe vessel in the Boscalis fleet, installed 108 perfectly round scour protection filter layers on the seabed. In total, more than 165,000 TE filter rock and an additional 11 cable crossings were installed. Offshore Wind Force was responsible for the timely delivery of the monopiles and transition pieces from Alborg in Denmark to Belfast. In total, the chartered EIT Palmina undertook 22 voyages to deliver the 108 MPs and TPs. To avoid delays in installation work carried out by the jack-up vessels, a feeder port was designed and constructed in Belfast. Two jack-up ships were deployed for the installation of the monopiles. The Pacific Orca, one of the largest jack-up vessels in the market, and the sea installer. Offshore wind force was responsible for the extensive mobilization operation to prepare the two vessels for their specialist work. The jackups were equipped with an in-house designed up-ending bucket and a gripper frame which was designed by a specialist supplier. After the arrival of the jackup vessels in Belfast in early April, the installation of the first batch began. As the weather plays a decisive role in all parts of the installation process, a customized forecast system was developed and integrated into a detailed planning system. The monopiles weigh a mere 500 tons each at almost 60 meters long. The transition pieces are 35 meters high and weigh 340 tons. One cycle of loading, sailing and installing takes about 7 to 8 days. An offshore wind force crew with 20 years of heavy lifting experience operated the installation desk on board the jackups. By using the innovative buckets and gripper frames, the world's largest hydro hammer and state-of-the-art survey equipment, the installation time of the foundations was reduced by almost 40%. On deck, the monopile is upended and subsequently lowered into the gripper frame. The world's largest hydro hammer then drives it into the seabed. Once installed, the transition pieces are leveled and the annulus between the transition piece and monopile is grouted. When the grout is cured, a specialist team removes the leveling bolts, cover tents are installed and the foundation is ready for inspection by the client. After handover to the client, in-field cables are installed and wind turbine generators are placed. The energy is transferred to land through a substation using an export cable, which is laid by another joint venture between Boscalis and Volker Wessels. After the installation of the cables, a Boscalis fall pipe vessel will place the final scour protection layer around the piles, using a total of 95,000 tons of rock. The completion of the project is expected mid-2014. 
at West of Dudden Sands, Boscalis offered tailor-made, innovative and economically attractive solutions and established its name as a successful transport and installation contractor.